Hi, I'm Mark Filipousis and today we're going to be talking about the serve. Another very important thing on the serve is body transference into the serve. And that's where you can get a lot of power into the serve. One of the things is racket head speed does give you power. But if you do want that extra power and get up there in the 120s, 130 mile an hour, 140s, you need to have body transference into the serve. And where it all starts is the legs. So for me, I do have a lot of weight going to the serve. I'm a big guy, I'm six foot five, you know, 215 pounds before breakfast. So, um, and, and I do try and get in there. Um, and a couple of things that I work on also is, is, is my feet. You know, I would practice serves without hitting the ball, but doing a, uh, just doing my normal rhythm and rocking back. There are a couple of things I work on. Everyone's a little bit different, but for me, I start off normal, and as I take the racket back, you see my body weight gets on the back foot. It gets on the back foot. When, I'm, when my hand's up on top, and I'm in the position where almost like scratching the back, my foot has come together, and it's bent, and this is where I'm about on contact, I jump right into the serve. You know, I've got a lot, a lot of momentum in the serve, and that's, that's one of the reasons why I serve so hard. Um, and again, that starts from rhythm, but also weight transference. So let's do that again. Start forward, I'm gonna be, all my weight is forward. As I go back, I rock back. So my weight is going on my back foot. I come forward again, they join together, and then I jump into the serve. Now a couple of people also don't like to move the feet up. You know, they normally just stay positioned. Certain players stay in position, which is fine. If you feel like you're more comfortable keeping your feet in the same position, that's fine. Yeah, but if you want to come forward and join them together and jump into it, whatever makes you more comfortable. Now, if you want to keep them locked in position, you would just do the same thing. Obviously, as the momentum comes back, you still have weight coming back. But then you want to have more knee bend. And then you'll be jumping into the serve. So again, you want to hit the ball hard with a lot of power on the serve. Remember, body transference is very, very important. So, hope to see you on the practice court.